Each Monday.com project has columns in order to track everything your work needs. Monday.com also offers basic forms in order to populate those columns, but those forms are just that, basic. With Fillout, you can create forms that do so much more and still keep your data in Monday. If you're looking to supercharge your data management with monday.com, you're in the right place. In this video, we're going to look at how you can build beautiful, smart, powerful, customized forms with Fillout and seamlessly integrate your data directly into monday.com. When you create a task in monday.com, you can list details like status, description, its value, and its due date. The more data you have, the better your team can perform. You need a tool that can handle this data and one that is able to capture and use it in your workflows, no matter how complex. This is where Fillout comes in. Here I have a project tracker in monday.com. It includes complex properties and fields, and so I need to create a form that can handle this data. With Fillout, you can create powerful forms and seamlessly connect them to monday.com. Open the Fillout form you want to connect to Monday, and then head to the top navigation bar and select integrations. Select monday.com, and you'll be prompted to provide your API key. This is easy. Just navigate to your monday.com account and select the avatar in the top right corner. Then click administration, then connections and API. Here, you'll find your API key, or if you don't see one, just simply select generate. Copy, paste, and then select connect. You'll then be asked to select your workspace and your board. Choose the workspace and board you would like to sync responses to. Then click continue. Here we go, setting up the integration. Under mappings, select add new and select a field or column in your monday.com board from the drop down menu, of course. Now you want to match the fields in your fill out form to the corresponding columns in monday.com. So work your way through all of your data, but I'll just quickly include a few for the sake of this video. You can also include static data, like I've done here. And finishing it off, ta-da. Excitingly, you can also use logic to perform an integration only when a certain rule or condition is met. Just head to the bottom right and select the condition symbol, then add the rule that determines when this integration gets the green light. Now, when you're ready, it's time to select finish setup. Head to the top right, and if we then run a submission of our form, I'll just quickly make my way through these questions, skipping those that are unrequired as we go to do. We can see that monday.com has been updated. And there you have it. For more tips and tricks on everything Fillout, make sure you check out Fillout's helpful docs and resources.